Do you need to add some utility to your simple keyboard and mouse, or do you need to cut back on your macro key addiction without sacrificing functionality? Yeah, that sounds pretty cool! Do you use complex design programs that require the use of many keyboard shortcuts, like Premiere, Photoshop, or Blender 3D? Oh, do you want to party harder than anyone else yes! in a universe where party means to send a vast succession of keystrokes and commands via macros to accelerate workflow? Yeah, I like to party! Do you use a Mac? Yeah, I use a Mac! Get out. I'm just kidding, but this program only works on Windows. I'm sorry. So, Pi menus, also called radial menus. Many programs use them because they can easily access a multitude of functions using a button and a directional control. They're especially useful to people who use pen tablets, dials, or analog sticks. However, I wanted radial menus and auto hotkey, which is a relatively user-friendly scripting language used to automate tasks with a wide range of complexity. This is mostly a response to seeing how others and myself use macro keyboards, which would involve users looking away from the monitor, or moving their hand away from the most accessible hotkeys, and repositioning their hand. Using Pi menus can give users macro functions without sacrificing hand position, and also doesn't have the necessity of owning a macro keyboard. Using this script will turn one of your keyboard, mouse, or pen tablet buttons into a 21 macro menu, which allows quick access to a designated function. I try to make this as user-friendly as possible, but I'm only an artist, not a coder. There are seven functions in each of the three Pi menus, and I chose for it to be this way because I felt that was a good number of functions to remember all the positions for. The labels only appear after a certain period of time, and I feel that this pushes the user to memorize the locations of the functions. Uh, you can also turn this delay off, but that's just lame. As of this video, I have made profiles for system browsing, Photoshop, and Google Chrome. If people want any other profiles for anything, I would certainly be willing to make them, but... I'm just kind of curious if anyone finds this interesting. Of course, AutoHockey is a fairly simple scripting language to learn, and there is a dedicated forum. If you want to put your own functions into this, uh, I do have a video linked on how to do so. Also, if, you, if you're going to learn the program, like, just Google everything. Like, that's all I did. Quick recap, if you need more accessible macro keys, use Pi menus. If you use a pen tablet, Pi menus. menus. If you use complex software that menus. could benefit from the use of AutoHockey scripts, hey, he Pi menu. Pi menu. Hold on. Okay, dude, I, I really need you to calm down. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about pi, I'm talking about Pi menus. Did he say it? Yeah, I said it, but it's over now. Well, I told you so. No, no, please stop. <laughs>